Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of How Logical. Today, we'll be guiding you through how to change your email on your MeFit account. If you want to change your email address on MeFit, then you'll need to go open your web browser since it's not possible to change your email address on the application version. Before starting, I would like to request you to subscribe to our channel by hitting the subscribe button and press the bell icon so that you'll never miss another update from us. Now let's proceed further. Click open a web browser and type in account.me.com and press the enter on your keyboard. Sign into your account if necessary and once you're in, you'll be taken to your account section for Mifit. Now, under sign in method, you can go and click on the recovery email option. Once you do that, you'll need to verify your account by receiving a verification code to your email address that is associated with the account. Click on send and wait for the code to arrive. Let me click open a new tab and now click open the email that you received from Mifit. Copy the code, go back to the account verification page and simply paste the code in the text field. Now click on submit. From the pop-up, you can go ahead and enter a new email address that you would like to change to. Once you type in your email, you'll need to verify your email address. Click on next and it will take you to a verification page. Enter the code that you received and click on OK. You'll need to enter a verification code sent to your new email address that you just entered. Go and open up your email and you should receive a code from Mifit. Simply copy the code again, go back to the page and enter the verification code in the text field. In case you didn't receive the code, you can click on didn't receive a code link right here, follow the instructions and you'll be able to receive a new set of code. After you're done, click on submit and you have successfully changed your email address for your MeFit account. That is how it is easily done. I hope you found the video to be helpful. If you did in any way, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Feel free to comment down in the comment box if you have a question or a feedback for us. I'll soon be back with more contents like this. Thank you for watching.